right. Hello, COM45 class. My name is Shayla Tinoco, and today I will be talking about the essay Toys by Ronald Bartz in the Reading Pop Culture book. Um, the essay begins on page on page 36 and ends on page 40. So basically the essay is about Bart's opinion on toys. He believed that children become users instead of creators when they play with plastic toys. Um, he noted that modern day toys were just smaller objects that adults use in their everyday lives, um, which I believe to be true. I remember having many kitchen toys and food toys and I would prepare meals for my parents and pretend to wash the dishes and pretend to like chop and slice up the food. Um, it was really fun. <laughs> um, but on page 38, um, Barthes makes this quote or says this quote that says, um, toys always mean something and this something is is always entirely socialized constituted by the myths or the techniques of modern adult life then he goes on to name many toys that are inspired from um uh, occupations and or adult concepts like doctor toys or means of transportation like toy school buses cars trains motorcycles um barts argues that because we expose our children to these types of toys we are preparing them to accept the world that is already made for them instead of them creating their own world which i agree with him on because most of the toys I played with as a child molded me into the person I am today. I played with baby dolls as a toddler, which I believe in some way prepared me for when I do decide to become a mother and have my own children. Um, as an older child, I played with kitchen and food toys, which exposed me to the role of maintaining a household or housekeeping. Um, I also played with a lot of Barbie dolls, which taught me about beauty standards and essentially was preparing me for the real world. Um, another point that uh, Barthes makes, which I find to be really funny and interesting, is that he dislikes plastic toys, plastic and metal toys. Um, and he prefers wooden toys because he states that wood lasts longer and is more softer, more malleable, is a more malleable material compared to hard chemical, chemically made plastic or cold hard metal. I don't entirely agree with his point because at the end, like in the end, toys are toys. Whether they mean something or not, he argues that wooden blocks allow children to create meaningful objects and become a creator rather than a user. I believe this can also be done with plastic toys, for example, Legos. I love and I loved Legos as a child and I still do. Um, I like them because you can create something from scratch and just build anything. Um, children have creative freedom when they use Legos because you can make anything out of them. Uh, although wooden toys do last longer and allow for sensations and memories, so do plastic ones. They might not last as long, but the memories created with them do. And basically that was the article that Ronald Bartz had um, with toys. Um, join me next time for my next vlog.